it's even moderate drinking, this is where, with that damage to the DNA, it actually could end up causing cancer and, and yes. all kinds of cancer, not just liver cancer. If you test the effect of ethanol on human tissue, it damages it. And so there's an issue of replicating the DNA accurately. Every time we drink, alcohol comes through our digestive system being metabolized into acid aldehyde which will literally burn human tissue that it comes in contact with. The body then has to repair itself. If you repeat that over and over again, drink, burn, repair, drink, burn, repair, they will become a failure to replicate. The DNA will not replicate, and that's when Got tumors it. can occur. Cancer of the mouth, the throat, the esophagus, the stomach, the rectum, the colon, breast is a huge issue. I mean, there's different proportions of these cancers caused by alcohol. I think cancer of the mouth is up there at about 30, between 30 and 40 percent are alcohol caused. The further down through the digestive system it gets lower. I think breast cancer, the estimate about 15 percent of breast cancer deaths and illnesses will be alcohol attributable in, in the U.S. There are also then, of course, not just the physical issues like the disease we talked about, but there's also cognitive issues that come up that people have to take into account absolutely 